guys to a brand new video. I'm going to show you some tips and tricks for Gander Map, because it's a pretty interesting map where you can do some really cool tricks on. So the first really cool trick here is you can have some really amazing head glitch right here, and it's pretty OP. I've done this multiple times, and I thought I was actually hacking through walls. And it literally you can just never see me. I look like nobody's going to come that way, so I'm going to try to go over here. There's also some pretty nice head glitches. You can camp right here in this corner. It's also a nice, good spot to camp. Now, I thought they would not expect you to need to hide right here and also check here. You can just sound hold for this side and look that way to check Cafe. And then people are head glitch right here too. And some people also hide over here. Wait, where are they at? Like, I don't see anybody. Also, you have to watch sight. People love to camp on sight. Just remember, normally just look for their feet under these like different objects. Because you can see their feet under every single one. Let's go ahead and backstab them here. Where are they? I'll try to get a good shot on them. There we go. Here's a second one. Ah, uh, aim assist is OP. I want to show you this amazing bomb spot. I mean, oh, no, I want to plant the bomb. I want to plant the bomb. Let's leave them alone. I want to show you an amazing bomb plant spot. Hopefully they don't kill him, I just flashed, maybe they won't kill him. But if you plant the bomb right here, and then you go hide all the way over there where that machine is, oh my gosh, it works every freaking time. Like, go over there, they will not be able to see, you can see the bomb all the time. I just wait until like, they're almost about to finish on um, defusing it, and I just kill them. It works every time, it just wastes a lot of time. It really does work. That's also a good spot. There's not that many good things for T-Side, but there's a lot of good things for CT-Side. Also, it's good to rush A, but you have to be careful because you like to nade A and like um, flash it a lot, so you're really careful. So normally wait for the nades. If you don't see them, you can actually sneak across here really easily if they're not um, peeking up there was a guy he saw me. But they don't watch the spot carefully, and also you can actually run past here before they get to you. So you can just look on this side and they can't rush you at all. I really like it. And also, if you plant the bomb right here, you can actually camp from that spot right there. It's also a nice spot. I literally play this map 24-7. There's just so many cool things like you can plant right there. And then just camp it from here, maybe have your other teammate over there. You can just like literally camp right here and literally just get like some easy freaking clutches just from camping right here. It's honestly some amazing spots. Where's the last guy? I might join CT Narcan because the game is full of crap. Because there's, there's some amazing- Oh, join a CT. There's some amazing spots on CT side too. Like honestly, this is probably one of my favorite map when it comes to being how tac sorry, tactical? Yeah, tactical is. There's just some amazing, honestly amazing spots. The only thing I love is on freaking B site. So if you don't know, this map has freaking, it's a, um, what's it called? A four map instead of like a three lane map. There's actually four different lanes. You have A mid, you have B mid, and you have um the A connector, and then you have B long. And from this spot right here, you can literally watch the um B mid and um freaking B long. It's a really amazing spot. It's a really nice head glitch. And I can actually like camp into the SMG. Because it's so hard to kill me. This head glitch right here is so OP. Like they can, it's, it looks really big. On their screen, it's like really small. It's a really hard area to freaking kill them. Unless the person is like really good, like some really amazing revolver one tap, like my boy Lala is. But anyway, that's one amazing nice spot. Also, right here is a nice head glitch. But people normally suspect this a lot. You have to be careful about these plants. People love to hide in these plants 24 7. These are really big plants, and they're also really easy to hide in them. Show a good spot right here. Like, people will always hide in this plant right here. And you, you might lucky, but you really get hidden very well. It makes it almost impossible to see people. I'm gonna go ahead and kill this dude right here. I don't, I don't know why people keep leaving. Where's he at? Probably gonna plant B nine times out of ten. Well, let me check who it is real quick. Okay, that guy might be good. I need to be careful about this. See right here? Is he planting? Oh, I thought I saw him. Like, I wasn't sure if I saw him. It'd be about these glass rooms. Glass rooms to me are the most annoying thing. So when it comes to shooting at the glass rooms, the closer you are to the glass, is the harder it is to see. And it can be very annoying. Let me show, I can show you real quick. I think I'm gonna show you when we respawn. Like, honestly, you have to be really careful about the glass because you can easily die from the glass. It's honestly annoying as hell. I kind of wish you just had breakable glass. Like, when you shoot it, it breaks down. I can see it's going instead of just having glass you can shoot through, but also see clearly through. To me, that's really annoying as hell. But as you see, when you're really close to it, you can't see shit. But when you're far away, you can see a lot better and easily kill people. Now, it does make some interesting situation. This guy's obviously trying to team. Who is this? Who is this? I can't see his name. I don't know the guy. I thought it was somebody I knew who was trying to team flash me. But anyway, yeah, so the glass is, has become an issue. I really hope they add break up the glass to the game. That'll make the game a lot more better. Oh, people can rush through here without using if you like you can rush fast possible. You might see their leg once in a while. But they can beat you to that spot easily. You go ahead and fling them real quick and kill them. Hopefully none of them are camping. You gotta check old spot. Like check right here. They always camp right here. Like nobody's in cafe. Check plant. People love to hide in that plant 24-7. People love to hide over there too. Is that predator on the P90? I have to pick that up. You know with my P90. And Predator. Oh, this guy, crap. I was not paying attention. Let's say hi to this dude. So I think of some other um nice spots I know. I think that's it. There's just some really, honestly, I love this map. Like, it's one of the best maps there is just for tactical reasons. Are they gonna plant? That's Curly. 
they're probably gonna plant nine times a ten. Let's just do this and know how to plant. I mean, one in three. I hate when they have noobs who don't know how to plant. Do you think the new AK and Bullet Force is real? Yeah? <laughs> oh, if you don't know for Bullet Force news, um, what's it called? The developer, not developer, the modeler? He was teasing a picture of an AK. I'm not sure if it's gonna be in Bullet Force or not, but it would be very interesting. I'm also gonna show a nice camping spot. Now, I'm probably not gonna be able to get a kill doing this, but really good snipers can easily get kills from this. You can just camp right here when they rush across. It's really easy. You can also jump right here to see who's coming. I know people do that a lot. They're probably gonna steal the kill from me just because I see I'm so many people going over there. Let me go ahead and check, um, what's it called? Yeah, B-side, because nobody's on B-side. Nobody's watching it, of course. Oh, B-long is a also nice camping spot. It's a little too OP, like you can't do anything about it if somebody's camping B-long. But look at this window. You can, Nobody can get past you there. It's really annoying. Oh my gosh. Everybody, let me get the freaking, um, what's it called? The sniper clutch. My teammate's gonna die, I need two more to die. I don't think they're gonna die. Good camp right here. There's also a nice camping spot right, where is it? It's somewhere. Can you camp from here? I don't think you can. You might be able to. There's just honestly some nice spots. One of the most well-designed maps. People are starting to hate it. I think people are starting to like it now. Like, honestly, to me, it's probably one of my favorite maps, especially for a competitive play. <laughs> oh, I'll get wrecked. I know you wasn't expecting that crap. Also, I've been playing Claw, like, 24-7, so I'm a lot better at Claw now. Yep, I am recording. And again, if you want to sign up for the beta, just like Google it. That Android beta is super easy to get. And the update is coming out, I think, on the 17th. Oh, here's also a nice name spot because people love to rush this site. Where are they going? Like, every time I go somewhere, they're not going there. I can't show you this amazing spot. It kind of sucks. Nobody is in the plant. People always are in that plant, I swear. And then this plant right here, too. Oh, what did that? Was that a team flash? I think that was a team flash. Oh, they're at spawn? Oh, let me snipe, let me snipe him, let me snipe him, let me snipe him. <laughs> oh, wrecked. Oh, people always will camp in here, too, in this corner right here. I'm trying to just jump in the corner. Uh, nobody's in here. Oh, come on! <laughs> the smoke, I kind of gave it away. I'm just in here running around fooling through the smoke. I couldn't get through that door. But I think that's most of the tips and tricks I'm going to show you guys. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video, and if you really care, subscribe. Peace, guys.